Four of the Apocalypse is a spaghetti western directed by Lucio Fulci, and I quite enjoyed this one. This one is definitely a nice surprise. This one is about a gambler. He is a cad of a man. Don't remember his name, but basically he rolls into a small town and gets bullied by the sheriff and arrested. Uh, and he basically meets his cellmates. There's a young woman who is a prostitute uh, who got picked up for, you know, her profession. And then there's a black man and a drunk. So the four of them are sitting in a jail cell when vigilante um, people show up into the town and shoot a whole bunch of people and lynch them. Uh, they are kept safe by the sheriff, however, and let go after the gambler bribes the sheriff. And the four of them go on a wagon. And they're basically going to head down south where it's safer, you know, away from the vigilante killers. However, they get harassed by a bandit, um, a villainous man who decides to tag along and sort of control them and then leaves them for dead, basically. So it's a bit of a revenge story. It's a bit of a romance story. It's a bit of a road trip movie. It's basically the pitch of this movie is basically like, what if you're in a spaghetti Western, but instead of being the grizzled badass or the villain, you're an NPC, basically. You're, you're one of those people off to the side, like the civilian commoner who's not good with a gun, you know? If people start shooting at each other in the street, you don't join in, you run and hide behind a barrel. That's kind of like the concept of this movie, which I really like because it's different from other spaghetti westerns. You know, our main character isn't it's just a gambler guy, you know? And then you've got the side characters, uh, the, uh, the, the prostitute, the black man, and the drunk, and they all have their storylines and basically... Uh, it becomes really somber by the, by the, by the end of the movie. It's, there's a lot of emotional parts of this film I really liked. Uh, it wasn't your typical action-adventure story. It was more of a road trip movie, self-reflective. And then, of course, uh, the ending really sells it. The last half hour really brings everything together for a really powerful film. So this one was definitely a nice surprise. I definitely liked... Um, that uh, the version I had was weird though because there was two scenes that were in Italian dubbed because uh, the film wasn't complete so they just added those scenes in so you got to be careful um, I got a DVD from the video rental store so if you, you got to be careful if you get a um, Blu-ray like re-release of this make sure it's all in Italian or make sure it's a uh, remastered version so I really like this film I give four of the apocalypse a seven out of ten